you didn't scare me. This is natural. Don't you worry. Everything that I've done here today is 100% good to go. The Dookie Brown Town, taking the Browns to the Super Bowl or dropping the kids off at the pool, whatever you want to call it, it's all 100% what everyone does. Let's jump over really quick and we'll take a look from a message from one special person. Whoa. Hey guys, I'm back. So as I was saying before, everyone poops and that's okay. Some people talk about it more than others. Us fat peeps, we talk about it way more than we possibly should, but we know that and we do it just for you. But the important thing here is let's learn from amazing master. His name is Taro Gomi. And he's told us in this amazing book, everyone poops, that everyone does indeed poop. So let's take a look at his insightful message inside of this book. Even on the front page, he's beautifully illustrated that this raccoon takes multiple sizes of Dookie Brown Town. Isn't that amazing? One animal, so many different types of poops. On the first page, we see a giant elephant. And look it, a giant poop. An elephant makes a big poop. Insightful, Tara, very insightful. And a mouse makes a tiny poop. Can't even see it. Isn't that fantastic? A one hump camel makes a one hump poop. Only one hump on that poop. And a two hump camel makes a two hump poop. Look at those two humps. Just kidding. Oh, Taro, you trickster. You got me, that's for sure. Fish poop. Look at that little strand, the dibbly dibbly dang. And a dibbly dibbly dang with two dots. Two different fish, two different poops. Bird poop. We got that little blue jay right there, little blurts, and a toucan. Their poops are more similar though. And bugs poop too. We can't even see it. Oh, Taro, you know what's going on. You're teaching us so much. Different animals make different kinds of poop. As you can see, the whole wheel of poops. Different shapes different colors, and even different smells. Oh, different smells indeed, Taro. Have you ever smelled a cow's poop? Hooey! Which end is the snake's butt? I don't know. We don't see no poop, but they definitely do poop. We know that, right, Taro? What does whale poop look like? He's struggling, he needs some fiber. Some stop to poop. The hippo's gotta push it all out. We saw those funny videos on YouTube where it's spraying everywhere. God, I love those videos. And others do it on the go. Deer's gotta run while they poops. Look at all those little deer poops everywhere. Man, Tara, you must have did a lot of research for this one. I, I admire you for this. Some poop all over, like little rabbits. One time, we brought home a rabbit from my school. And 10 years later, we were still founding poops. So this is very accurate. All over, all, all over. It was horrible. Other poops somewhere in special places, such as the raccoon. I don't know where he poops. That's a mystery to me. But us humans, we poop in that turlet. At least I hope you're pooping in the turlet. You're not pooping there. At Less if you're out camping. We make exceptions for that. Grown-ups poop. Us adults poop. Definitely. Kids poop. Just like you. Well, some of you. I know there's some adults watching. That's you. Some kids poop on the potty. Other poops in diapers. Very true. Very poop. Very poop. Some adults poop in diapers, too. So let's, let's be inclusive, Tara. I'll, I'll add that for you. That way we're all inclusive. Some animals poop and don't even think about it. 
Man, that rhino, look it. Just dropped him. It just fell. He didn't even feel it come out. Some clean up after their poop. I didn't know armadillos did that, but definitely cats. They bury their poop. Clean little buggers. These animals poop by the water. Elk. This one poops in the water. Alligators, crocodiles. That's why they tell you don't drink the water near an alligator or crocodile. Not because they're going to bite you. They might have pooped in it. He wipes himself with toilet paper. You better. Then flushes it away. This year it was a little bit harder for him to use that toilet paper. You guys all know what I'm talking about. When it was in stock. All living things eat. Giraffes eating the trees. Lions eating the carcasses. Gorillas eating the fruits. Bananas. Zebras eating the grass. Pelicans eating his fish. Pigs eating his slop. Kids eating his porridge. We would all definitely eat. So what's the natural conclusion here, Tara? Where are you leading us in? So everyone thus indeed poops. Look at all those different shapes, sizes of poops. So Tara's made his point with this beautiful, wonderful book. So make sure you know that everyone poops. And from us over at the Fat Peeps to you, make sure you have your poop knife ready at all times. I don't this time. I don't know where it went. I gotta get a new one. Anyhow, I hope you guys have a wonderful day and enjoy this story as much as I did. Join us next time where we give you more insightful, wonderful stories from your childhood and beyond here with Read With Me, Fat Peeps Special Edition. Have a wonderful day, guys.